Hey everybody, how's it going? Max with Buzz Talks here, and I'm back with another reaction for Westworld Season 4, Episode 2. I'm um, not really sure what's going to happen. I'm excited to see what unfolds. It seemed like Dolores was in some kind of a pattern. I know in the featurette, um, Evan Rachel Wood, the actress who plays Dolores, said that she is a human. I don't buy it. Um, I don't think it adds up. Um, I had a theory when I was watching it last, and I... Uh, I thought that she could have been a human based off Dolores and she wrote those stories, but um, timeline-wise, it doesn't seem to make any sense uh, because Westworld was founded 30 years ago. Um, they wouldn't have had this modern world 30 years ago. I think that was like 2018 or something. Um, so the fact that she is human, I do not buy it. Um, but without further ado, the episode is going to start. So let's, uh, let's see how it goes. Here we go. Hold open. Clementine? <laughs> Nailed it. I'm one for one. It's like they're trying to have us believe that this is a human, Clementine. Hello again. Okay. They have a friendship. Like, they have history. So this is the house. I believe that she saw William and that California guy. Senator. You want to buy us some privacy? Security. Let's keep this between us. If he thinks he can send you two here to try to twist my own... Oh, that's excessive. That's not your husband. Your hosts. Just like me. Took you long enough. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jesus. Just shoot him in the. <laughs> Meg, base code only. Who are you? An emissary of a new world order. How many others are there like you? As of now, 249. Jesus. The original senator and his wife. What did you do with them? There's always so much to process. Um, yeah, wow. I, <laughs> you need time for it to like seep in because there's so they give you so much information. Uh, the one thing with Clem, um, God, like you need to see more to, to dive into it. I find it weird that William was wearing his cowboy outfit. Um, it could be one of William's copies that's working for Charlotte. He's clearly looking for Maeve. That's all I can say about that. In terms of them replacing people in high places with hosts, uh, like the senator, I, that's obviously going to be very common. With the world that Charlotte wants to build, she needs 
to have control over people who are in power. And that's where you start. Okay, so we've been here before. Probably brought Clem back as an assistant, maybe to use strategically for Maeve. Maeve's been known to attach to things. Plot. You're invited. This is messed up. Free me. I can't do that. You don't have a chance. What are you doing? She was already gone. And she may have been human. She wasn't like any human I've ever seen. I don't know how they're going to explain this. So bizarre. More city shots with no tower. Walking the same path. G story? It seems like they're presenting like a 5G story. Like the cell towers release airwaves that kill the birds. It could corrupt the mind. Like, you know, like all this conspiracy type stuff. But then there's the fly. And he's mentioning a frequency. So maybe the flies give off that frequency. I don't know how they're going to explain and justify that they can control a human's mind. Friendly warning, Bill. You go ahead with this. We're going to burn you down. Where's the vice president's copy? Fly. Mm. <laughs> mm -mm. I don't know how they're going to explain this fly thing. I really don't. They've been on that train for a long time. Perfect mimic of the Angela scene. He may be rather basic, but he's still capable of pulling up his own trousers. I'll leave you to your selection. Wow. When William was in there, he didn't partake because of his wife he left at home. And then he met Dolores. And that happened. Caleb's in the park, left his wife at home. Same kind of behavior as William. It's an interesting uh, parallel. Old as shit. Hi, 
Hi, Chrissy. What's up? Maya? The obituary you read for Peter. It said he left all of his money to the Hope Center for Mental Health, right? Yeah. Why? Oh, no. Don't tell me. I'm at the clinic right now, and it doesn't make any sense. This place shut down years ago. Mm-hmm. So, Peter's will was out of date. It happens all the time. You don't understand. He did make a donation when he died. They dedicated it. In... Trust yourself, Chrissy. Yeah, they're in the future, man. Like it's been a long week. Come home. I'll be waiting for you. This is interesting. He's like kept on ice, kind of like a uh, like they're storing him. Bring him out when he's needed. Do you know where you are? It must be disorienting. You again? Why do you need me? Why don't you just let me die? Because you were as close to a god as a man gets. You and your associates created a world in which you absolutely controlled our every move. And now, I'm going to do the same to you. I think it's time for a deep and dreamless slumber. So this is the real William, I think. Jesus. Oh, hey, at least he's alive. That's great. Good evening. And thank you all for coming tonight. Crushed by loss. It was our darkest hour. And yet, we came roaring back. I believe he's talking about 1910. Um, 1918, I believe, was the Spanish flu. <clears throat> Which do you prefer? Never really been. That makes sense. They're going okay. to the 1920s right now. That makes sense. And he's I'm announcing ready to their true selves, this new yeah. park. And so, in the interest of giving the public what they want, we have broadened our horizon. Wow, okay. So it looks like that is it then. Um, yeah, all in all, you know, it was a good episode. It was slow. It was more establishing. Um, but I appreciate, you know, the the establishing that it's doing. Um, my initial reaction is I'm a little confused about the human control where they're using flies and then they talk about the tower... Um, almost giving off a sound and controlling people. Um, we got some of Charlotte's motivations where she wants to um, ensure that she has control over the humans before sh so her kind can li live safely in that world. I need to really think about what her plan is. Um, it's cool to see that William's still alive though. I think he'll be useful. Um, but I do like the idea that, you know, the idea of my daughter Dolores, I think it's still open. I think Jemmy Simpson could totally return. But then there was Caleb and Maeve, and with their storyline, I'm still trying to figure out. That was probably the best scene in this episode, was when the senator and his wife were turned, and, uh, they had to fight them, and then seeing his human wife was pretty, uh, pretty crazy, pretty intense. And uh, that, that kind of goes hand in hand with, you know, she was controlled. She became psychotic. She became like a, a malfunctioning host. You know, what happened with the hosts was once they started breaking their loops and they started hearing their reveries, they started to go insane. Um, it seems like they're doing a weird duality thing with uh, humans. Um, so at this point, I guess they're doing some investigative work and they're in a new park. So... I don't know. Yeah, we'll we'll see what happens. It was uh, 
really information heavy. A lot of things are diving in. But anyways, let me know what you guys think about this episode. You know, where do you think it's going? Do you have any theories, any thoughts? Uh, let me know. Uh, but until next time, I'll see you guys later. Thank you.